can you believe this collection has taken me two and a half years to build? Buying all these card packs, making all these trades. Nerd. Did we really have to bring our kids? Did you really have to wear that tie? I'm being really interesting right now, I can tell. Usually my personality is a little flat. Did you ever pick up on that? That you have a personality? No. Guys, remember, at school, I'm Mr. Belcher, so treat me like you would any other substitute teacher. That means you get a mean nickname and we assume you live a horribly depressing life. In this case, we know it's true. Um, I think your mom was going to go to Jean's Weird Play and I was going to stay here and watch Tina. Ah, uh, I don't think so. We need your giant body to make the audience look fuller. But working girl's the film that inspired me to be anything I wanted to be. And so you're this? Why does everything bad happen to me? It's happening to us too, Tammy. Well, not really, because you're not blonde. Neither are you. You're looking good on that big girl bike, Louise. Thank you. I mean, I'm being nice. Over my classy new awning? <laughs> yeah, I noticed, Jimmy. You wanted it that ugly, I guess? It's big and shiny, like your bald spot. <laughs> ah, male pattern baldness. I got it too, I think. It's made from old Ferrari bumpers. I couldn't care less, Jimmy. I'm yawning. <gasps> I'm yawning at your awning. Tina, you need to take that off right now. Sparkle jelly bracelets are my thing since yesterday when I bought it. Yeah. Tammy, I understand you're disappointed. I'm a little disappointed too. Before I saw it on you, I thought this bracelet was classy. I'm gonna get neighborhood babysitting jobs to pay for my hair dye needs and there's nothing you can do about it. Ugh, you're as dark as your dark, dirty roots. You hear me, Tina? Yes, I wear glasses, not hearing aids, Mom. Oh! Well, I don't wear a hearing aid either, so I didn't hear that. You don't want to mess with my sister. She'll wear down your self-esteem over a period of years. Mm -hmm. Shut up, four eyes. Oh, I'm talking to four years. With four years, I can ignore you twice as hard. What, 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 what? I feel coming better. It's the largest member of the rodent family. After Jean. Uh, huh? Who's soft now, Louise? Your stomach, your butt, and your thighs. I chose you, Dad. Thanks, Tina. Over the shark. Thanks. Because I thought... Yes. Originally, it looked like maybe I would... Yes. Oh. Yeah, Dad. Who was Tina really gonna choose? A broken down wreck with the dead eyes or a fake shark? Aww. You like that, Mom? Yeah. What? Ah, really? You want me to leave? Yeah. Well, chant for it. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. That's right. You can't chant. I mean, you think I wear these shoes? Because you don't care what you look like? It's not your fault you lost, sweetie. It's his fault. Hey! Button that, you seventh inning bitch. Mad pooper. Tina, we're trash talking. Stop turning it into a normal conversation. Oh, sorry. Um, skank? That's much better! Uh, I hate your new hair color. Give it to me! Your eyeshadow is a little much? In the face! My face! Well, who would want to hire you, anyway? People who like the smell your mouth makes when words come out? No, more like people who like people whose hair is all the same color. People will hire me to be a babysitter, Tammy, because I'm nurturing and kind. Things you wouldn't really understand. You could do worse. I don't see how! What's the point of clinging to this if I'm doomed to be that? Huh, I don't know. When? Why wait? Let's do it now. I want the whole bob. Male pattern baldness, mm. stooped shoulders, Stop. paunch, Please. and the push broom on my lip. This is incredibly insulting. You look ridiculous. Oh, I look ridiculous. Yeah, you do. You're both right. Dad, if you believe you're beautiful, you will be. I did. But maybe we can do something about that hair? Did you wash it? I owe you my life. No thanks. I've seen it and I'm not impressed. You go to Rudy's and have a cannelloni all alone. Oh my, she just rhyme burned you. Put some lotion on that. Look, you know what's happening right now. She's cramped in a way too small space, nauseous from diesel fumes, and this guy's B.O. You just described her life with you. You regret not going to college? Come on, it's not like you ended up flipping burgers. Oh, wait. The name's Frond. James Frond. I've got a license to counsel. Double O so sad. Louise, be nice. Why? It's Mr. Frond. How much more cursed can you really get? What, is he going to give you an even weirder body? Thanks, Louise. You got it. Wow, it's almost like music. Well, season five, episode 12 called, and it wants your costume back after you wash it. Oh. Something smells fishy. You! <laughs> <laughs> he got you, ghost burn! That's not funny. <laughs> I thought you guys were gonna go trick or treating. And I thought you guys were gonna actually go into the mausoleum. Dad's chair is almost done. He'll never have to stand up again. Dad's thirsty, he's got a water bottle. He's cold, box of matches. Now he's bored, not anymore. Here's a basketball. And then I can use this dish towel to wipe the floor with you. Because I just won the mistletoe. Dad will never walk again by choice, nor will he love either of you again, by choice. It's middle-aged mom Barbie! I like your hair, it matches your teeth. But you have to actually win races to finish in first place. Maybe you didn't totally understand that? <laughs> Keep it up. Way ahead of you.
Literally. Maybe a few of him taking out the trash. Yeah, why don't I take out the trash instead? You copied my bracelet, Tina, and now you want to take my stapler? Why don't you staple your mouth shut? Because your face keeps falling open and dumb words keep coming out. <laughs> you gotta hide somewhere. How about behind Dad? I'm not big enough. Keep telling yourself that, pal. Yay, Dad! You're pedaling like crazy and not getting anywhere, just like your life. No, am I like bland and a safe snacking choice? I was just wondering if that's what people think of me. Oh, I don't think people think of you. Old people are scary. Being an old person is scary, right, Mom and Dad? Hmm. Hi, it is. Daryl, I heard you're going to be E.T. for Halloween. You might want to phone home to me to congratulate me on winning. You, you could do bad stand-up. That's really popular. A lot of girls have it worse. Yeah, look at mom. Uh, the sign says no motorized vehicles on beach. <laughs> oh my god, you are a motorized vehicle. It also says no trash on the beach, Tammy, so what are we gonna do here? <laughs> oh my god, it does say that. You guys were supposed to get sticks. Where are the sticks? This is a mega stick. What's happening? Would you like a suggestion where to stick this log? Tina! You heard me. They make great gifts. Well, I mean, they make gifts. You showed a t-shirt at a guy like a girl. Ah! So, like that? Your mom's really scary right now, and if I untape you, I, I don't know what she'll do to me. Ah! I hope your worms are hungry. Tina! Oh, too much, sorry. Oh. Louise, I asked you to take this out to the dumpster last night. Oh, the dumpster dumpster. I thought you meant something else. If we all die, everybody, thanks for being cool. You're welcome. Oh, Randy, I forgot you were here. What do you think of my pinch pot? It's, um... Well, you made it. Right. What's the point of waiting? Nobody gets better looking, huh? <laughs> right, Dad? Louise. Sorry. Also, how can you trust an animal with a head that's that bald and tiny? I mean, we trust Dad. That's true. Uh. Look, I know your tiny little brain doesn't understand things, so let me help you out here. This is a sledding hill where people sled. We present to you the first ever tomato trophy for best dad who is also pretty good at business. Congrats. Wow. Is that is that supposed to be me? Yeah. Red and lumpy. Tina got a boyfriend with no mall game at all. Hey, Tammy. Inside voice, okay? Brian really needs a sleep, and you sound kind of like a toy that needs new batteries. Ha! These slotted spoons are very slotted. No slot shaming. Um, did anyone else think that guy's mustache looked a little weird? Who, Dad? You get used to it. Unlike those slackers 50 years ago? No offense, were you one of them? No. How old do you think I am? A lot. How old is Dumbledore? Hey, Tina. I've pressed my face on some loose leaf paper so future people can see how I did my makeup. It's great, it's in, you're welcome. The only problem is that Wagstaff is a grade school, not a clown college. <laughs> it wasn't totally dumb, just like mostly stupid. Just like you, Tammy. Please don't smash mirrors because they don't deserve that. I mean, they taunt you every day, don't they? They really do. Home ec isn't for honor students. It's where dum-dums learn to make ice. You know my daughter's in that class, right? Yes, Bob, I do. What else is new? Good luck with your b your blemishy face. My what? b b b b, -b Good luck with your speech therapy. God! I won't use the really bad ones. That's all of them. Okay, new rule, Millie. No using any of those coins. I didn't realize today was bring your mother to school day. Um, hey, Matt. Your grandpa called. It's you. Oh! <laughs> yeah, yeah.